guys, so I thought I vlogged today, but apparently I haven't, so hello. It is, I was going to look for my phone, but I'm filming on it. It's, um, what do you call it, 10.15 on um, Saturday the 19th of January, March. Hi, it's been a lovely day today. Um, I spent most of it in my pyjamas. I did have a shower and everything, but... Um, yeah, it's been a lovely day. I think it's gone up to like 16, I think, outside. It was like 14, so had my window wide open. Um, and I've done absolutely nothing. Basically, I was watching videos, and then me and my boyfriend called. Um, we sorted out his visa application. Um, it's much easier this time around because we've been together. We've been together. He's done this once before. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Uh, because he came, he visited in... Um, December and obviously we applied for it in when it then we got G. Um so we applied for it in September last year and obviously he's coming again in three months today. Three months this this time in three months he will be here and uh, we'll be at home doing absolutely nothing. Maybe nomming on a pizza. Subway, we don't know. Um <laughs> but yeah, so he's coming in June. Nineteenth of June till the Something of July. <laughs> One minute, let me check. I've got um. I asked him to send me his um, flight confirmation, so I know exactly which uh, what airline he's going with, because I am very nosy, and also the flight number so I can track it, and also um just because of the letter of invitation which I'm going to be writing tomorrow. Completely forgot about it today. <laughs> going to be writing it tomorrow. Um, that's all I have to do this time around. He's got my passport. Um, or well, photocopy of my passport passports here and um, he's also got um a photocopy of my tenancy agreement to prove that i do rent this flat and i do live here um it's quite tedious um applying for a visitor visa for your partner to come over here it's not really that tedious um than maybe marriage or something like that that is much more tedious so if we were going to do that we would have to have a lot of evidence of him coming to visit me and i'd have to We'd have to have evidence of him coming, me coming and visit him. Also, we're talking about flats. I was like, I was talking about like how much my flat, like my flat's around three hundred fifty ish pound a month. Um, one bedroom flat, masonette thing. Um, that's housing association housing though. But um, and his flat, I was like, he was looking at one that was hundred and ten pound. I was like, oh, for a week, and he's like, no, a month. I'm sorry, Bosnia is a very cheap country, but, um, like, the wages are completely different, like, the wages are, like, half of ours, like, not even, like, a third, I th I'd say half, uh, around a third, I'd say, um, I don't know the average, because he has a particular job, so, averages might be different, but, £110 per month, and I said, <laughs> I said to him, if there weren't many issues, like, with health-wise in your country and stuff like that, I'd live there for a while. I'll just move in with you, but I, I'm happy living in England, and yeah, so, yeah, he's here till Saturday the 9th, and it would be a Sunday, Um, he was supposed to come on the 6th, 5th, 6th, sometime in the beginning of June, but the flight we were looking at was uh, quite pricey, Um, and this one was, um, I'm, I'm noting this down just because the flight price changes in the future, uh, but this was 270 euros, or well, 270 euros 41 cents um and that's for flight to england and from england um which dude i think he was gonna come on the 11th no he was gonna come on the 13th but that was a monday just because of transport stuff but he's coming on the 19th and i'm staying over two nights before um and then on the way back i need to book this as soon as possible on the 8th to the 9th, we're staying overnight at an airport hotel because his flight, I thought he was going to get the one at half one in the afternoon. No, he's getting the flight at 10 past 11 in the morning, which means we have to be around the, at the airport around 8, half 8-ish. Um, did you say check-in closes like half an hour, an hour and a half before departure or something like that? So we could just stay at the airport and chill for a bit. That's what he suggested. Uh, but yeah, so that means we'd have to be there around 8, which means we'd have to leave. Um, I'm hoping to get an Uber this time around, just because I'm going to be going when... I'm going to be going home when he's going. Um, so 
last time I went to the airport with him and then I came back, had the breakfast and then went to the airport again to get the train home and it was just too much for me so I'm checking out and then I'm getting my suitcase to the airport then. Um, we could be there by nine o'clock, half nine-ish really, um, but we'll see what he thinks um, and then because I am, I am going to be paying for this Uber myself um, just for peace of mind and stuff. Um, I haven't told him that yet because <laughs> there is a bus. There is a bus from the hotel because this is practically next door to the hotel. If you've seen the video with me vlogging, um, I'm looking out the window and the left hand side of the window is Premier Inn, Runga Lane South. And then there is, I think it's Runga Lane, I don't know. Uh, and then there's, on the right, there's Premier Inn North and that's where I'm staying. Um, and then we're staying at the same hotel that we were staying last time on the last night he's in the UK. So, um, yeah. Does that make sense? I don't think it does. Um, but yeah, so I need to sort that out now. So I haven't done anything today. I made a lovely, lovely little to-do list. Uh, I had a palaver because I was like, some videos um, that should be on my YouTube that I need to download to edit were not there. Um, they already downloaded. Future Victoria sort this out first. But, um... Uh, yeah, so, um... So I'm going to try and get some stuff done today. I don't know how long I'll sleep, just because I have some stuff to do. Like, I want to do, do go to bed on time, but we'll see. Um, yeah, Holiday Inn is, um... It's a good... I like it. Uh, very boring. June, July, maybe to the ninth. Oh no, not one guest, two guests. Oh, it still says I'm in Greece. <laughs> I'm not in Greece. I'm in the UK. I was using a VPN, that's why. Right, one minute. My stomach's acting up. Right, it's going to be 130. Wow. That's not the right hotel. That was really strange. Anyway, <laughs> you've given me the wrong Holiday Inn Express. I, I put Holiday Inn instead of Holiday Inn Express. Uh, but that's where we're going to be staying at. Uh, let's, let's do this. I've done an adult again. <laughs> I mean, it's going to be the same price. £101. Poons. £101. So, yeah. Let me just edit this. Wow, July is literally, it's really strange, like I could click June and then I can't click July, I could click July. Anyway, hi. Um, yes, I haven't done much today, which is not good. I haven't done any laundry, I haven't done, no idea. I, I completely forgot I was on about then. I'll, I'll stuff that out in the future, I really can't be bothered dealing with it. Um, anyway, hi. So, um, what am I going to do? I'm going to chill until I go to bed. I just want to get some stuff done, but we'll see. Um, maybe an early start tomorrow, just because I have a lot of stuff to do. Because I'm silly. Um, I just keep procrastinating on stuff, which is not really good, so. It was chocolate. <laughs> but yeah, I played Minecraft with my boyfriend. We've got our own server, so yeah. It's very very hoot but yeah I got a lot of stuff to say but for my internet bill has um not gone up however um because I changed the payment day I didn't get a bill last month um so it's kind of nearly double of what I would actually pay so that's an expense 
um and what else completely forgotten hopefully we, we're supposed to get like a rebate of 150 pound in april so that will help a lot and um, because i have got to save it off for this hotel stay um obviously going to manchester and stuff like that we've got to sort out train tickets um it's just <coughs> a lot of stuff right i'm looking for united utilities um because They never... Oh, yeah, they did give me that. I was like, where's this £5? Yeah, they did give me that. Anyway, sorry. Because um, they took out my money early. So they were like, we're going to give you £5 and that's apology. Thanks. I mean, it didn't bother me because I got paid on the 25th. So, but, yeah, I'm getting paid on the 25th again. <laughs> uh, Friday or Saturday? I haven't decided yet. I'm going to be going out... Uh, not for a, a weekly food shop or anything like that, because frankly I get stuff in a food bank. Um, but I am getting some snacks for my and my boyfriend's calls, because um, I like a snack. Um, it's probably gonna, not going to be much. And then... Um, what else? Maybe some Easter stuff, because Easter is at the end of April, I think. And I can't wait till the next time I get paid because there won't be anything less. Sunday the 17th of April, so i got to get my Easter goodies in this month. But yeah, so I'm going to do a video of what I got for Easter, even though I'm buying it myself. I like those type of videos. I think I showed you guys last year. I got a couple of Easter eggs. The uh, thing is, I get multiple Easter eggs in one day. And I'm hoping not to do that this time. Maybe just one a day or... <sighs> If I want to restrict myself that much once a week, but we'll see. Uh, I also got like lollipops, I got sweeties, and that's it. So, yeah, so I'll see what I can get this time. Um, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna make a list of what I'd like. I've already made a list, packing list. I think I talk about this, I don't know. I made a little packing list of what I want for when I go to my little staycation thingy. It's just to give me a lot of self care because last time. When he came in December, uh, there was a lot of stress. Um, I didn't sleep at all the night before I slept for two hours. And I was just all over the place and I ended up breaking down. <laughs> he had a little nap in my bed and I was like, I was crying in the kitchen because I just got so overwhelmed. Um, so I want to take it slow this time. I need to sort out my flat, make sure it's nice, clean, tidy because everything, there's so much stuff everywhere. You're seeing in the clean little desk area that I have, except for the cup. Um, but... What you're not seeing is piles on the floor, kitchen's overrun with tins, bedroom's got laundry that needs to be washed, so is the bathroom. It's just everything everywhere. So, I, w I mean, I have three months, so I've got to keep doing a bit a day. And um, future me will be very, very appreciative of it. And I've got to get a finished DE100, DE100, yeah, DE100, uh, get my studying sorted and done and stuff like that find my laptop charger because i was going to go to the lab library city obviously that never happened um but when i get paid i want to get stuff for my that's what i'm supposed to get as well stuff for my lunch um so i could go to the library whether it's the library in my town or blackpool i need to figure out where the toilets are because i am one of those people who cannot go to a place if there's no toilets I'm just like my dad. <laughs> That's all I can say. I'm just like my dad because my dad's like that. Um, I'm also going out for a treat on the 28th. Um, this is just a one off. The next time I'm going to be doing this is when my TMA handed date is. TMA handed date is. And the next time I'm going to be doing that is when my boyfriend's here. So um, it is my TMA handing date. Um, it says here um, Tuesday the 24th. So on Tuesday the 24th of May, um, if I have that money money left over i will go to the pub that me and my boyfriend went to um and have uh, my little um treat meal yes <laughs> but I, I i probably will vlog it um i don't know what day we're on on the 100 days of vlogging thingy um 
I think I'll do weekly vlogs after. I'm not 100% sure yet. If I'm going to do weekly vlogs, I want to have an end date in sight. I don't want to keep doing it. I just keep doing it and doing it forever because that puts me off. Um, I think I have a challenge of doing... Last time, I think I went up to 20 or 30. Uh, this time would be 50 or if I'm pushing it, 100, which is going to be technically two years. I think, and I think I like that challenge. Um, it will obviously start after my boyfriend's being here, just because I don't really want to vlog when he's here, and just because um, he probably doesn't want to be put on YouTube. <laughs> um, he might do, he might not want to, but it's just, I mean, like I said before, this channel's about me. If you don't like me, I'm sorry, this channel's kind of about me, so... Apologies if you don't like that, but uh, I created this channel when I was 15 about me and it's still about me and Rose as well and then now Poppy, so anyway, <laughs> but yeah, so um, but I think I'd like to do that. Obviously, it'll start for Vlogmas like I did in 2019 uh, and then it'll start right after Vlogmas. Um, I may take a break or two, like a couple of weeks off. So it may take longer than two years because if my boyfriend's here, I'm going to take off weeks off. And if I go on holiday somewhere, well, we never know what's going to happen in the next two years. Um, obviously, they will pause then, but um, I'd like to give myself a challenge. And then if I'm still enjoying it at week 100, I will continue doing it to, say, week 200 of week 250 week 300 you know that stuff like that so we'll see anywho that's my ramble for today really hope you enjoyed coming to my TED talk about absolutely nothing and um tamagotchi anyway yeah i'm gonna go now before i make your ears bleed and yeah i'm gonna have my medicines now i've been talking to 18 minutes hope you enjoyed see you tomorrow bye